Hello everybody, how we doing? We're gonna do something scary today. Something evil, something twisted. We're gonna watch a bunch of kids die. Probably. We'll see in a second. Okay. Uh, settings. Subtitles, yes please. Um... No. Okay. Well, I don't like scary games, but I guess we're gonna get started on this one, cause, cause why not? The butterfly effect. A tiny butterfly flapping its wings today may lead to a devastating hurricane weeks from now. Tiny butterfly devastating hurricane. I think there's going to be a theme to this game. A little tiny butterfly. A small decision can dramatically change the outcome of the future. Blah, blah, blah. I think that's what it said. I didn't actually read it. Your actions will shape how the story unfolds. Yes, I get it. It's like a choose your own adventure game. I get it. Your story is one of many possibilities. So play the game multiple times. Choose your actions carefully. I'm gonna rush everything. Creepy cabin in the winter? Okay, check. Good, 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 good. Okay. Random girl number one. Is there a window somewhere? Oh. We're just going right into it? Oh my god, I can't believe you actually did this. Do you guys think this is a little bit Oh, come on. She deserves it. It is not her fault. Oh, I see what they're doing. I'm just looking out for my girl, Em. Mm hmm. Just because he's class president doesn't mean he belongs to everyone. Mike is my man. Hey, Em. I'm not anybody's man. <laughs> Whatever you say, darling. Someone's gonna get chopped up. Oh, this is mean. Mike. Oh, this is just mean. Hey, Hannah. Oh. I hope everyone but Hannah dies. Oh, so that's not one of the friends playing a joke. Hey. Dad said it'd just be us this weekend. Yeah, Beth, I think that was just you. Josh. Am I playing now? Oh, I'm playing now. Okay. Hello, drunky. You okay? Oh, good. It's like Resident Evil controls. Blech. Okay, maybe this way, yeah. I saw a big Death Star painting here. Yep, that's a big Death Star painting. Okay. No idea where I'm going. That's not a door. Is this a way? No, that's just a wall. Hmm. Oh, what'd I do? I pressed the wrong button. My bad. What's the point of using this to, like, look around if your character doesn't actually look around? Oh. Okay. That could be inspected. The more you know. Okay, piece of paper. 
press R2 to pick up the note. Oh, there we go. Eh, eh, there we go. Hannah, you look so damn hot in that skirt. But I bet you're even hotter out of it. Come to the guest room at 2 a.m. Mike XXX. Oh my god. What did our naive sister get herself into now? Something stupid. Oh, that's glittery. I can interact with that. It's a bottle of Jeremiah Craig. Single bourbon whiskey. Well, straight bourbon whiskey. Oh, the good stuff. Jeez, Josh. Josh knows how to party. Once again, brother, you've outdone us all. Oh. Is this the death flag? What's a death flag? Maybe we should start with a little, you know, making out and see where it goes from there. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, she's going straight for it. Oh, my God. She's a huge What? Oh, my God. Matt, what are you doing here? Uh, Hannah. I'm sorry, Hannah. Hannah. Hey, this all got out of hand, but... Stupid prank. Uh... Ooh. You guys are jerks. You know that? Hannah! Wake Josh or find others. Oh god, the first choice. Uh, I want to wake up Josh first. Oh, that was dumb. Guys, there's someone outside. What the hell? Hannah! Whoa. Uh oh. What's going on? Where's my sister going? It's fine. She just can't take a joke. It was just a prank, Han. What did you do? It was just messing around, Beth. It wasn't serious. You jerks! Hannah! Hannah! So after her? You know, I kind of think you're the last person she wants to see right now, Mike. Oh, God. Oh, Quick time events. Oh, I have all day to hit that button. Uh, uh, uh. Safe. Footprints. My, no, oh, I'm making all the bad choices, aren't I? Okay. Unlock my phone. Okay. Hannah. Hannah. Okay, clever. Cool, cool. Oh, I can even aim it up and down and all around. Flipping the light. Mm hmm. Okay. That only startled me a little bit. Well, oh, that, that's it? That's the difference between the walking and the walking faster? Hello? Hello? Oh, there's a thing here. I don't know if I want to pick that up.
I'm gonna pick it up. Grab it. Okay. Um. What was that? Oh. Death totem. Indigenous tribes believe that butterflies brought dreams and pro premonitions. Each totem piece foretells a possible future event. How how you play will determine whether or not these prophecies come true. As you unlock totems, the events of the past will become clear. Okay. Oh. Okay, a bunch of butterflies. Oh, oh, wrong button. Sorry. I wonder how close they were to naming this game Butterfly Effect. Uh, that was a glowing light in the distance over there. I am now going towards the glowing light. What the hell was that? That was fire. Hannah. Hannah. Hello? Hannah. No, I don't want to know the choices for this chapter. So dumb. Oh god, I should be paying attention. Oh man, rip your phone. What is this thing? Oh boy. Hold on. It can breathe fire. Hold on. Oh, it's a person. Oh, yep. Okay. Oh, god damn. Hmm. I wasn't gonna let a sister die. You know? I need to make sure you understand. Okay. You see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is beyond our control. You have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom in this revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. Okay. Get a little close there. So, you have committed to commence with this game. This is significant. And I want to help you see it through. Sometimes, sometimes these things can be a little scary, even terrifying. I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. Hmm? Okay. All right. We will start with a simple exercise. Could you please pick up the card? And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about I can't place his accent. It is essential that you answer honestly. He's got a weird accent. Maybe it's just a lisp, like a slight like, lisp. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm 
I'm picking it up. I have a glove. Oh, I don't know if I'm a man or a woman. Come on. Rotate. There we go. Oh, that's lovely. Yes, that is a lovely, um... Scarecrow with a hook for his hand. It's not creepy. So, how did that picture make you feel? Remember, be honest. Hmm. I feel uneasy. Okay. I don't like the hook for the hand. Don't like the hook. Hooks scare me. The scarecrow. Well, I see. I see. Let's see. The scarecrow were not there. Would you feel comfortable staying there on your own for a period of time? Say a week, for example. Yeah. Just a barn, right? Huh. And what if I told you that this cottage was haunted? Be a little scared. A little spooked. Oh. Alright, alright. I sense that you suffer from a significant fear of, of the supernatural. Okay. It lies beyond the veil of death is, after all, the ultimate unknown. Don't you agree? And what could inspire fear more than the terror of uncertainty? There's boobs in the picture in the background. Just saying. Generic scruffy white guy voice. Well, we seem to be out of time for this session. This is interesting. But we'll talk again very soon. Okay. What an interesting way to tell a narrative. With this weird meta thing. It's just a game. Don't worry about it. His only game. Why you have to be mad? Sony Computer Entertainment. Yes, this is Costume Quest. Welcome to Costume Quest. Next we'll be playing Minecraft. But like the haunting version of Minecraft. Is that blood? That's blood. It's like a vortex. That's creepy, doll. I don't like that. Tonight, the Washington girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and headed out into a snowstorm. Foul play. Not a year ago. No. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was. Oh, my goblins! Forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? My officers did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marge. Well, thank you for joining Pretty sure they at least broke their backs, so... Their son Josh, on this, the anniversary of Probably doesn't look too good. Of Hannah and Beth Washington. Well, hello, friends and fans. Alright, let's do that again. Oh right. yeah, what a cool guy. Well, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. 
Um, first off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. <laughs> so, um, let me just let you know, uh, let's take a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. Yeah. I know you're all probably worried about me, and I know it's gonna be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year. Worried about you? I just want you all to know, um, it means, it means so much to me that we're doing this, and that I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together. In a yeah, sense. they both kind of didn't like you when they died. I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you, and, um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for... For the sake of my sisters, and, you know. Okay, so. Oh, no, wait. Let's Josh. Okay, never like mind. Josh was okay. Josh was the guy that passed okay, out at the bar. Make this one trip we will never forget, alright? Yes! <laughs> Matt. Matt was the dick. Oh, it bothers me that that metronome's out of time with the music. Oh, make it go away. <laughs> that was the scariest thing so far. Creepy rocking horse. Cool. The chapel. Blackwood Pines. Have a nice trip. Get it because they fell off a mountain. <laughs> oh yeah, it was out of time. So I'm pretty sure it was. Ten hours until dawn. Oh, that's the name of the game. Oh, cool. He's back already. <laughs> Can't wait to have you back. <laughs> oh, you. Okay. Sam, diligent. Hannah's best friend. Considerate. Adventurous. Uh, yes. I'm gonna walk fast. Ooh. Creepy door. With note on it. The gate busted climb over from Chris. Well, what? <sighs> Damn it. Time to climb. Ooh. Oh, he, Jesus, never mind. He just said you had to climb it, lady. Oh. That. Probably supposed to climb right here, aren't you? Yeah. I'm going to climb safe. Oh. Haha. <sighs> 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 Why would you stand at the top? Oh, that's someone watching me. I know you're over there. Aww. It's a little squirrel. Hey, you hungry? Huh? 
Don't move. A sign here. Can I read it? I can. <laughs> cool. Indigenous people and butterfly prophecies. Uh, tribes who once lived in these mountains believe that butterflies capture dreams and prophecies of possible futures. Color butterfly indicates the nature of prophecy, death, danger, loss, guidance, and fortune. Dreams and luck. Yellow is good. Okay. 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 As you explore, you can discover totem artifacts. Picking a totem up and turning it will reveal a color butterfly. Oh, I didn't get to read that. Yellow! Okay. Can I, like, re-look at that? The future is uncertain. Whether or not the prophecy comes true depends on the choices you make. Press R1 any time to view the totem collection. Oh, I can rewatch it. Can I rewatch it? Okay. Weird. But informative. Can I bring out my phone? It's dark. Okay, I'm gonna go into the cable cup. Oh, Come on, button. Chris? Chris? It's cold. Bag's here. Where are you? You're not in the bag, are you? Ha ha ha. I'm on a snoop. Aha! Look who it is. Ooh. <laughs> he knows you. Chris. Ooh. Chris has a crush on Ashley. Protective, humorous. I'll be the judge of that. You scared me. I I'm sorry. Are, are you my secretary? I was buzzing. Cool. Well. Thanks for letting me know. I, I can take it from here. Why does Chris looks like he look like he's twenty years older than her? Oh, so Oh, it's blonde hair, not gray hair. Found something kinda amazing. What? I'm not gonna tell you. You gotta see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. Where? Right around here. It's gonna blow your mind. <laughs> oh, wait for me. Don't leave me behind, man. Don't leave me hanging. Ta -da. Pretty rad, right? What is it? Yeah. Come on, look at these beauties. Uh, beauties is not the word that comes to mind. Why oh, the guns. What do you mean? What the hell is a shooting range doing at the base of the ski lodge? Uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He's, he's like Grizzly Adams or something. <laughs> Wanna try? Uh, no, you go ahead, Chris. All right, here goes. When I'm playing as Chris, oh, I get to shoot things. Neat. Press R two to shoot. Yeah. Mm hmm. So, girl. 
Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. Oh no! No, I'm not gonna shoot the squirrel. Yeah, you madman. I see what you're doing, game. Hey, sharpshooter, a ride's coming. Wait, you're trying to tempt me. Come on, Chris, tempt me to do bad car. things. I want to see some orange justice, Chris. Where's the button for orange justice? Wanted. Nice. You think we'll get a visit from America's most wanted? Wanted. Someone Victor Milgram, male, oh, six foot on, two. Of animals of the year. Last known address here. here. Uh, cool. Gee, I wonder if we're gonna run into him. Probably. Yeah, I checked it earlier. One of those to keep it locked, to keep people out. He said that. What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. It said on the sheet he was male. That's for you. A oh, real gentleman. Snowboards, bruh. I'm gonna go up here. <sighs> Take a look, see doodle. I thought the car was closer. Guess we gotta wait. Mm-hmm. Looks looks nice. What a crazy place to set up house. And no matter how rich you are. Not so rich. They only bought a mountain. They only bought a mountain. Only a mountain. I'm watching you, security camera. Is that it? I don't know about you. Okay. Finally, you coming? Yeah, well, I was gonna stay here and catch some Z's, but okay. <laughs> Creepy old cable car. This is nice. What a nice time we're having. Just like going to the prom. Here we go. Who's right. operating this thing? definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something. I don't think it's this, that this tasteful as you guys think it is. It's hard to tell with him, and I, I'm kind of a bit worried. No, no, it was it was a good idea. I don't think Everyone so. Everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. <laughs> you know what? Let's just let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. 
Victor is running the cable car. It just goes straight into knives. Josh sat in the back of the room. I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. Victor. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front where I was sitting. Okay, so. So I got moved to the back. And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. Mm. Match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early, and on that day decided to wear a low cut shirt that showed off her train bra, I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone right now, or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. Ooh, we said it. I bet that was the running name for this game. Butterfly Effect. Ryan, can you fact tap can you fact check that for me? I'm gonna need a fact check. Jess! Mike's new girlfriend. Is that like his hers like new new girlfriend? Confident, trusting, irreverent. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. New people. Time to meet and greet. Jessica! Oh. What the hell? Jess, hey! Jessica, over here! Uh, are you guys having a really weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please? Yeah! Why would I not? What happens if you don't? Oh my god. I thought we were goners. Another ten minutes in there and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick Chris. Look, I got a lot of meat on my bones. It's all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh-huh. Hey, Chris. <laughs> I'm just doing like Sam taught me. Other people's private thoughts are my own personal playground. Do not be a jerk. My goodness. Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president, Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Mike and M split. We're together. Whoa. Drama. Drama. Pretty clear cut, actually. M's out, I'm in. Oh. Gimme, gimme. Alright, alright. Let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? I mean, you know, whoever. Sam? <gasps> Did you see this view? I mean, holy cow. Sometimes I forget to just stop and take it all in. Seriously, couldn't they have built the lodge, like, right where the cable car ends? Emily, Mike's ex. Intelligent, resourceful, persuasive. Hmm... I don't think it would have been like as pretty. Matt, Emily's new boyfriend, motivated, ambitious, active. He's active. No. And where's the bellboy when you need one? Oh my God. Matt, dump this girl. She's not right for you, Matt. <sighs> getting chills. We're almost there. No, I mean getting kind of creeped out. Oh. Weird seeing everyone up here again. Mm-hmm. Definitely not gonna feel like it. I mean, what do you think? Oh, Jesus Christ. Jesus! <laughs> Mike, Emily Zex. Intelligent, driven, persuasive. <laughs> you guys. Michael! You really, really should have seen your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice one. Michael, you're a jerk. Cool. Guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. Welcome Remember the last time you tried to do harmless fun up here? Uh, let's get into the Two girls things. died. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? <laughs> Try to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being. You always get like this.
I'm gonna be a cool guy. Michael, I'm just gonna lay it out. Otherwise, this whole weekend's gonna suck ass for everyone. Um, this is super awkward, and we all know it. Let's just uh, acknowledge it now and move on, okay? Nah. I hear you, man. I get it. I don't want to make this weird. Cool. So we're good? All good. You guys gonna make out now? Oh my god, totally. We're so gonna make out. Uh, no. Seriously, I'm gonna go check on the cable car back on the trip. Right. See you, man. See ya. All right. See ya. Bros. Oh, crap. Total bros. What? Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? The bags? Yeah, all the bags. Uh, why? I need to go find Sam. Uh-huh. Okay. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up. Uh-huh, sure. I can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. Uh-oh. No, I'm not leaving you alone. Uh uh. I really don't think you should head back I'm down not letting you go yourself. meet up with Mike for your little makeout session. It's cold out and it's getting dark. You're gonna protect me from it being dark out. I'll Mike totally sure plays Fortnite. Come with you. Nobody's gonna Mike it. is a total Matt, chad. Are you kidding me? You can't leave me alone for five minutes. You really think that little of me? That's not what I meant. Why can't you just listen to me? Why do you have to question everything I say? I'm sorry, Em. I'm just Sounds like you're about to go make out with that guy. If you want to be helpful, then you can help get everything up to the lodge as quickly as you can, okay? <sighs> okay. Fine. Whatever you want. Thank you. I'll see you up there after I go find Sam. See you in a bit. Is that all eight? No, we're still missing two. I think. <gasps> Ashley has a crush on Chris. Academic, inquisitive, for forthright. I was trying to be the nice guy, okay. I shouldn't have been the nice guy though. Oh, I'm gonna see something spooky. Is that okay? There's um, there's what's her face, Jessica. Um. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. <gasps> They're not in the friend zone kind of way. They might need to check the expiration date on their big breakup. Ooh. Oh, Jesus Christ. Hey, whoa. <laughs> Sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare Jeez you. Louise, well, Matt. I did mean to scare you, sort of scare you, but not like... Jeez really. Louise, oh, Matt! Gosh. Oh, my God! Hey, wow. Man, I'm, I'm really sorry, Ash, Dan. It's okay, it's fine. It's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh, it... Let me check it out. No. Ooh, this is hard. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know which one to pick. Uh, yeah, it's kind of busted. It's not. It's not like really interesting. It's just what? For real? I, I bet I could find like a cool bear chowing down on a fox or something. No, really, Matt. It's not worth straining your eyes. I'm getting kind of a headache just from looking through it. So just no, no. All right. Uh, sure. So. Sorry, Matt. I'm not gonna do it to you. I'm not gonna put you through that kind of heartbreak. Not on this, the best weekend of your life. It's a total party weekend, Matt. Tons of girls here. Back to Jessica. I don't think Jessica's the type of person to read a book. What a jerk that Mike is. What the hell am I 
to retaliate. What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? I, well, I don't know when you put it like that. Hey! <laughs> oh shit. Yeah, screw you, Mike! Oh, That's for cheating on me. Chickadee. It's a little weird. Oh, ah. Ooh, I was close. I almost missed that one. Oh, look at that cute birdie. Hello. Come on. Hey, Mike. What if it wasn't Mike? This is too cute. Something bad's about to happen. Sometimes doing nothing is the right thing to do. I'm not gonna hit the bird. Why would I hit the bird? Oh, here's the luck thing I saw earlier. Oh my. Right. My my. So are we calling it my favor then? You're worthy opponents, Miss Jessica the Snowball Queen. Okay, that sounds vaguely dirty. My lady. Kiss him. Kiss him. Yes. They're about to get axed up, aren't they? Wow. Save some for later, buddy. Endless. Oh yeah. We should get up to the lodge. Yeah. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. Mm. I mean, I could stay out here for pretty much ever, provided I was making out with you the whole time. <laughs> Just making out? Ooh. Quote, unquote. Well, what a slut. I think we might freeze to death somewhere between those quotes. Yeah. Didn't they just start dating? Pretty sure they just started dating. Who's that in the cable car? Ooh. Okay, was that chapter two? Hello again. Hi, Dr. Hill. And Your name Hank. Like I'm feeling good. In our last session, we established that you have a fear of things that are dead. Okay. Yeah, it's fair. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Now, pick up that book. <laughs> That's a big book, man. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. Is there a picture of school? Um, women worry me, yeah. Swipe. Eh, uh, planes scare me more than crowds. I don't mind crowds, really. Oh, you see, this is just... <sighs> this is evil for me. Um... I think I fear drowning more than heights. I fear them both pretty equally, but snakes. That was a very masculine looking woman, yes. Okay, Doc. Oh. Oh. Guns are scary. Guns don't kill people. Knives kill people. No, I'd rather 
snake. Apparently cockroaches fly, though. I didn't know that. What's with... every? Oh, God. Christine, look away. Oh, God. That's a creepy clown. I don't like that. Ugh. Ah. I think scarecrows scare me more, though. Scarecrows are just creepy. Ugh. You know? I think that's a crow, but it really looks like a raven. Um, guts. Startle you? So sorry. You're doing very well. What the hell, Doctor Hill? Don't be nervous. Yeah, like heights versus drowning. I don't think I'd like you. one more than the other. Speed up. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience. Cause you don't like clowns. Oh. Ooh, snakes or spiders? Hmm, spiders. We don't like you, the spiders. Needles. <laughs> crows, man. Scarecrows. Something about scarecrows. Not dogs. Needles. Is it... Am I... Am I picking out what they're going to torture me with in this game? Is that what's going on right now? For answering so diligently. diligently. What a fun word. Spiders, scarecrows, and needles. <laughs> Some combination sounds like a good Friday night. <laughs> Spiders, scarecrows, and needles. Oh, yeah. That's accurate. Well, I'm afraid. Once again, we're out of time, but I promise we'll talk again very soon. Okay, go look out your window. Previously on Until Dawn. Dude, I was just there. Okay. Man, I really don't like Jess. First off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Spoiler, getaway. they die. I really want to spend some quality time with each and every one of you. And some quality time. Share some oh, moments yeah. that we'll never forget. Welcome to the Smooth Jazz Hour. Quality sister. time with Josh. Let me go find Sam. Whoa, hello. Sam's getting a little friendly. Oh, yeah. So High school drama. And next to Josh. That's how we met. Boom. Butterfly. So far, Chris is my favorite, I think. Man, I feel like this mountain gets bigger every time I climb it. Oh, yeah? That feels the same to me. It's Josh! Hannah, Beth's brother, complex, thoughtful, loving, and a fan of bourbon. Come on, my guy. Know, it probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. You got a spare million lying around, and I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I, I think I left it in my other jacket. Ha ha ha. Hey gang, you guys get up here okay? <sighs> Could've done with some bellboys, but uh, hey, can't get everything. Yeah, it was pretty easy. A little creepy though. I mean, it's really weird being back here. Mm hmm. Got this guy. I'm watching you. Yo yo yo. Plan is Chris. Moving up here or what? Yeah, man. 
Ben Emily. Are you doing all right? Hey. Yeah, there we go. You doing all right? Eco, you okay, bud? Yeah, I know it must be really tough about yourself. We're bros. I just meant to... No, I know what you meant. You know, seriously, I'm over it. And I just I want us to have a good time, you know? Like we always... Having a good time on the anniversary of my sister's death, so yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That's how you what forget. Else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in. They're just all locked. There's gotta be like a window around the corner we can get like get open or something. Wait a second. Are you saying we should break in? I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey, not if I don't report you. Um, <laughs> lead the way, coaches. That was a little threatening. Not if I don't report you. Hey, Ash. Hi, Chris. Confident. So, how are you doing? Yeah. Good, but a little cold. I think I could use some time curled up by the fire. Yeah, that does sound pretty nice. Oh, yeah. Curl up with her by the fire. Cuddle her real close. She's like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? And I just want to rip that parka right off of her oh. and make some snow angels, right? Cut it out, man. She's my girl. Hey, cut it out, man. Yeah, I mean, if you're not going to bang her, maybe Mike will take up the case. Wait, will you back off already? Relax. Just checking to see if there's some blood flowing down there. <laughs> yeah. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? <sighs> you and Ashley alone at last. You've laid all the groundwork. You've been a perfect Just saying alone gentleman. at last now, sounds so sinister. For the kill. Ooh. No, I like Chris. He's not about that. Chris isn't about that life. No. What if it's like weird? What if she she might like want to be friends with me anymore if I try something like that? Yeah, I mean, friend zone. Just listening? You gotta buck up, bro. Grow up here. Oh man. What do we a tool? Let's go, Josh. So how are we planning on breaking into my parents' lodge, bud? I didn't say I had a plan. It sounded like you had a plan. <laughs> you better deliver, Coach. Coaches. There we go. There's a there's a thing here. It's an axe. I could use that. Oh, it's gone. The axe holder is empty. Where be the axe? Is it in here? Mm -hmm. I'm getting pretty low in juice here. Uh, it's just gonna turn off my GPS. Well, 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 we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. Eh. Eh. That's right, climb up on there. <laughs> yep, don't hurt yourself now. Just unlocked window. Oh. Oh. I'm okay. Should have paid more attention in climbing class. Climbing class. You mean Jim? Yeah. You okay, know, there you go. Climb up the rope. Whoa. Did I do that? I don't, I don't think so. Here, use this. A <laughs> lighter. No lighter is that bright. Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? Totally. What, what is it? Okay, so I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's, it, how's a stick of deodorant going to help? Spray on. It's a can. <laughs> oh, yeah. Now I got gotcha. you. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the little army dudes. Yep. Ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and push. Bye bye frozen lock. Bingo. Alright, so you got this. 
I'm gonna Wait. go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, he had a lighter, and he yeah. just unfreeze the lock with the lighter. I am... I am the confused. Aw, oh, snowboard. You wanna go snowboarding? It's a thing. Is it a totem? Oh. Oh, shit. That is a flaming body. Well, let me see that again. Loss. The potential loss of a friend. Ooh. Is that Emily? That looks like Emily. I guess you could cover more area with the spray can. Okay. There's a, a snow plow or a truck here. Um, this is a room. Oh, there's a thing. I like things. Oh. Ex janitor convicted so for arson. Here. Swears revenge on movie mogul family. Hmm. Aggressive arson committed on Blackwoods Prime. Blackwoods Pine, that's where we are right now. Um, in census twist, the sentence ended with an in Grange Milgram screaming obscenities at Washington's heavy, heavily pregnant wife. Oh. Oh. You think that's Victor? That might be Victor. Victor, buddy! Why you have to be mad, Victor? He's only game. Victor, are you in here? Pretty sure Victor's the guy with the flamethrower. Oh, the newspaper said his name? I didn't see that part. Victor? Uh-huh. Okay. Huh? What the hell was that? Okay. Guess I have to go through the self-closing door now. Ha ha. Funny joke. Okay, hi. Hi, Chris. Very funny. <laughs> Oh, how'd you know it was me? Shouldn't you be, like, getting the lock open or something? On it. Okay. This way, I guess. Okay. Man, I got a bad feeling for Chris. What's up, buddy? There's a door here. It's locked. Aw. Prom night photo. Lovely. How romantic. Okay, I'm gonna go upstairs.
Because he said something about... Oh. I don't like that. I don't like the doors and windows open. What am I looking I'm looking for Josh's bedroom, I think. Please be deodorant. Please be deodorant. Deodorant! Oh, Jesus Christ. What the fuck? Ah, perfect. Oh. Jesus Christ. We're freezing our buns off out here. What a man. Crap, that thing freaked me out. What was it? Are you okay? It's just like a bear or a tiger or something. Oh, it was just a cute little baby Wolverine. Baby? Don't worry, buddy. You're gonna be a big boy soon. Let's go beer. Home sweet home. Sweet is not the word I use. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. Even if it's still kind of freezing in here. I'll get a fire to go. This place barely looks any different. Yeah, nobody's been up here. Even with all the police coming in and out? Not a lot of action up here lately. Nope. Action. What's up, party people? Hi. Hey. Hey. Hey, man. Make yourself at home, bro. Will do. Are there no other lights? Man, I wish there were some lights. <laughs> Emily is oh here. Oh my god, that is so gross. <laughs> Are you trying to swallow his face whole? Yeah. I mean, seriously, can she be any more obvious? No one wants in on your territory, honey. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you? Emily Not wants in on your territory, honey. Too loud. Sounds like someone's bitter she didn't make the cut. Yeah. All a big cattle call with that dream boat. Congrats, you're top cow. That's real beef calling this homecoming a cow. Chill out, Emily. Em, come on. No, shut up, Matt. Stay Ooh. out of it, you dumb oak. Hey, watch it. Oh. oh, you're the only one who can put him down? No one else can play with your toys? You're such a bitch. Whatever. I don't give a crap what you think. At least I can think. 4.0 bitch, on a roll. Suck on that when you're trying to sleep your way into a job. Who needs grades when you've got all the natural advantages you can handle? Ooh. You couldn't buy a moldy loaf of bread with your skanky ass. Are you serious? You think that's insulting? That bitch is on crack or something. Emily, stop. This is out of hand. And there's no reason to fight like this. Yeah, Em. Why are you picking fights over your ex-boyfriend, huh? Stop it! This is not why we came up here. This is not helping. Mm -hmm. It's not what I wanted. I want up here a good time. And maybe we need a little bit of a break, Enjoy right? some beers. Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. yeah. All right. Want to go do that? Any place without that whore. <laughs> it's right up the trail. Oh god, it's outside. Well, that's over. Yeah. So, Josh, uh, can we get this fire going? Where's my bag? Huh? My bag, the the little bag with the pink pattern, the one I got on Rodeo. Matt, are you, are you listening? 
Oh my god, don't you remember? Next to the Italian shoe place where I got the stilettos and you knocked over the rack while you were drooling all over that girl at the counter? Well, I mean, she was asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. Why do you hate my jacket? Matt, I need my bag. I'm glad I saw her burning in the fire. Do you seriously think I'd forget my bag? Well, do you? I guess not. You must have left it down by the cable car station. Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. And then we can get warm. We can get very warm. Okay. Oh. Okay. Let's go. Very warm. Very hot. Very bothered. Yes, that is good. Okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. I like Sam. <sighs> Exiled. Exiled. <laughs> Works for me. Oh, oh, these two are gonna get How killed first. This cabin, anyway. This cabin is the coziest, most romantic love den you will ever lay your eyes upon. <laughs> If we ever make it, I have a feeling luck's on our side. Play your cards right. Doubt it. Maybe you will get lucky. Hey, porn stars, you're gonna need these. Porn star? I'd pay to see you. Uh, gross. Hey, I'm sorry to kick you out like that. No worries, man. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourself. Mm-hmm. You have fun with the peanut gallery. <laughs> oh, I almost forgot. Gotta fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. It's dark out there. All right. Roger that. There are spots where the I game audio echoes. Me. Okay. Maybe because I'm listening to it from my TV. Wait, really? So maybe I'll just turn it down a little bit. There we go. <sighs> Probably a little better now. Oh, an actual proper flashlight. That's nice. Wait for me, M. You're not Emily. You're uh, you're Jessica, or Jess, or whatever. Okay, you had a cube of you. Hey, hot lips. Photo booth. All right, read my mind. It. And good. Oh my god, <laughs> this is perfect. We're like the cute. Oh my couple. god. You should be a model. You keep that camera handy, and maybe I'll let you start my portfolio <laughs> at the cabin. Josh is Victor. He brought up the spray can flamethrower, and he said he wanted to fire up the generator. Oh yeah. Josh is played by Rami Malik. Who's that? Sir, it is freezing out here. Uh, that's something I can help you with. And how are you gonna do that? Uh, I got a few things in mind. Victor, where are you? Oh, there's a sign. Not a lot of TLC for this place anymore. Kind of a bummer. He's an Egyptian actor. I don't think we fired up the generator. Emily's as dumb as she looks if she thinks she can cut in on what we got going on. Maybe if we're lucky, she'll try and follow us out here and get eaten by a bear. Yeah, totally. I think you bring out the worst in her. Is that so? Epic jealousy. Suck it. You're the one just being all gooey gooey. Oh, he's the new Freddie Mercury? Oh. Very cool. Oh, there's a way this way. Um. Ooh. Is this the generator? Oh, a totem! Oh, there's another death. Oh! Oh, shit. 
What happened there? Danger. Who is that getting punched? Oh, it's Ashley. Gets punched by some weird clown dude. Who was he in the last Twilight movie? Talk about it. You can't hit a girl? Hey, this looks like a generator. Alright. Let's see. I know the clown more than a scarecrow. Boom. Nice one, Mikey. Yeah. Woo, you are a wizard. You damn straight. <gasps> Hi, Victor. Hi, Victor. I don't want to be here anymore. Let me in. The gates shall open. Pretty good, right? Yeah, totally. That was awesome. Oh, yeah. I bring the hit. Ah. Uh, I don't like this. You psyched yet? You don't look psyched yet. Ho, ho, ho. So psyched right now. <laughs> it's like a little adventure. You're kidding, right? This game is not about a Wendigo. Because <laughs> I was legit thinking about that when they were like, oh, it's supernatural. Well, they never closed the investigation. Okay, I'm getting the creeps now. I think they're at peace. Well, wherever they are, I'm sure they're happy we're all thinking about it. Wendigos them. legitimately terrify me, so if, if this it. game's about Wendigos... I, I don't know, man. Oh, it totally makes sense now. They keep talking about Native Americans and butterfly effect, and oh god. Oh god, what have I done to myself? I. I'm. Do, 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 do. Do not light. What the hell was that? I don't think we can get up to the cabin with a path block like this. Oh, no way am I going back to the lodge, a.k.a. Wax Museum, to drink hot chocolate with Emily. I want to go back there. Oh my god, you dumb bitch. Fuck! Hey, Jessica! Yep! Hey! I'm okay! Holy crap, you scared the heck out of me. How do you think I felt? Uh, you didn't hit your head or anything. As far as I can tell, I still have all seven of my limbs. <laughs> Uh, yeah. One, get out? two, three, I, four, five. I don't know. I can what? hardly see anything down here. Oh, she's counting her boobs. Push the cart. All right, Jess, there's a cart. I think if you can push it, you can get by. Great. Okay, let me just try. <sighs> It's too heavy. <sighs> try again. <laughs> Alright, try it again. It's super heavy. Maybe you already loosened it a bit. <sighs> hey, Michael. I might pretty ripped it all, but I don't think I can move it. <laughs> 
other bright ideas? I'll drop the light for you. All right. Jess, you're going to drop the light down. Okay? Look alive. What? Look al All right. Just heads up. You get it? Yeah, yeah, I got it. <sighs> I also learned that apparently Wendigos are in Fallout 76. So that'll be fun. I saw that. I saw you, Mr. Creepy Guy. Ah, uh, do not like. Well, hello. Hello. Shall we? Do not like. Okay. Haha, ha, is only game. <laughs> oh, triangle. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, holy there we go. Crap. Okay. Oh my gosh. Are you okay? Who pushed the cart? Yeah. Carts don't just move by themselves. This isn't Minecraft. Okay. Totem, show me what you got. Fortune, how's that fortune? Is that Jess? Like, half naked? Okay. Okay, that was weird. I don't like that the zoomed in on him like that. That was weird. Right? The music's kind of eerie right now. Yeah. There's a clue. A blues clue. Jesus. This place is a real fixer upper. Danger. Danger, Will Robinson. Okay. Creepy things are still creepy. I don't like walking around corners. I don't think that's a ray of hope. I think this is a bad place.
I think I'm going to get axed up soon. Cheese me no likey. Well, well. When Joff said cabin, I felt like Abe Lincoln. <laughs> Where do you see the Lincoln bedroom? Oh, are you planning on getting presidential on me? Ooh. Wanna take a ride on Air Force One? <laughs> all right, all right. Save it for the stump speech, but ooh, a telescope. Gonna look at the trees. Gonna look at the clouds. Gonna look at the cabin. There were deer in the first part. Whoa. Someone at the cabin. Okay. <laughs> Let me see. I don't see anything. Uh, sampling the old eggnog again, babe? This is just us up here. Uh, maybe. I don't know how you'd be able to see anyone at the cabin. What was that? Oh, no, it's nothing. Hmm. Yeah, I don't see anything. Hey, Jess? Mm hmm. Stay close by, okay? <laughs> What's that? Oh, uh, this posting says there's some brown bears up here sometimes. Ooh, cool. Michael, I have the best idea. What? What? Let's go hug a bear. <laughs> Come on, please. Come on. Let's not hug a bear. <laughs> yeah, that's really not a good idea. Yeah. Well, I don't like that it closed behind me. Oh, there's a deer. Okay. Watch out for that bear trap. River. Nice weird bridge. Okay. Cabin. God damn it, Josh. Have you have at least cleared out the path before sending us up here? <laughs> Type. You got a better idea? Glass half That's empty. <laughs> oh, boo! Show off. Hey, Mike. You got something on your face. Ah. Boo. It was snow. Okay. Okay. Well, that's how it's gonna be. She's gone. Damn me! What? You wanna help me 
we get this fire going? Uh, well, I was just getting into the bath. Oh. With all my clothes on. Oh, do you need any help with that? Hardy are. I like Sam. I hope she doesn't die. Come on. All right, Josh. Let's see if you know how to hook up the hot water in your big fancy lodge. Nah, I'd rather take a cold bath. That's not just a bathtub. That's like a. That's like a three-person. Sitting, sip. Yeah, that's the word for it. Ah. Uh, you heard that too, Sam? Okay. That's a candle or a thing. It's a thing. Um, tattoos. March 18th, 2013, 9.30 a.m. There's a butterfly on it. Oh, stuff. This was Hannah's room. Huh. Happy Christmas. 2010. Can I close it? There you go. There we go. One more thing. Party! Dear Hannah, I would be delighted if you would attend my awesome party at 7 p.m. in 2013 by Mike at my house. Ooh. She had a crush on Mike. Well, that's right. She did. We already knew that. Duh. Okay, that's Hannah's bed. Okay, let's go find ourselves a... I think Josh... Oh, that way's blocked. Do, 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 do. Oh, there's a shiny thing again. Oh. There's a couch and some creepy masks. Don't take out the spirit board. Those things are a joke, man. Don't do shit. No way, bro. Don't take out the Ouija board. Josh, no hot water is kind of major oversight, don't you think? Yeah. Oh, yeah, you just got to fire up the boiler in the basement. Oh. All right, you guys see if you can find the spirit board. Chris, let's go find it. It'll be like a scavenger hunt. Pairing off like boy girl boy girl. Oh, so yeah. Brad, you're not going to regret it. You up for a ride along? Let's go get that water heater going. Fire it up. Oh, yeah. In the basement. If you know what I mean. how I gave Chris and Ash a mission together. Yeah, I was thinking they could use some alone time. Alone time. Yeah, Chris needs to go for it. And I just wish Chris would go for it. He's so paralyzed thinking she's going to shoot him down. It's not going to happen. Which thing? Well, neither. If he doesn't go for it, which <laughs> knowing Chris, he won't unless someone's holding a gun to his head. <laughs> That's an idea. Hold a gun to his head. Okay, we're going this way. You 
know, Sam. Yes, Josh? I just wanted to say... Uh, what? It really means a lot to me that everyone came back this year and, you know, that you came, Sam. We're here for you. Yes. We're here for yeah. you. Yeah. Really, whatever you need, whenever, we're all going to make it through this. Together. Um, <laughs> Surprised Josh didn't go for a fire reference. After all, he is Victor. Hey, watch your step. I think I can handle a little set of stairs. Ooh, that's a wall. Uh, I was wishing she was going to trip right there. Listen, all I know is the basement's a bad place to be in a horror movie. Okay, where'd he go? Oh, he's that way. Sorry to drag you down into the bow. Oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. I mean, I wouldn't want you Bowels. to down here on your own. You know? Well, it's... Definitely creepy down here. Yep. Not a place to be on your own. <laughs> I want that. Baseball in the snow? Be pretty rough playing baseball out in all that snow. No, it, it wasn't. In the winter, silly. I mean, we'd come up in the summer and we would have the best time. The whole family was there. Mom, Dad, my sisters. It was some serious competition out there on the big lawn. I don't know. I thought I saw something move behind him. Can't go back. New reality. Right, Sam? Anyway, I'm supposed to be fixing this whole guy, right? Push the big red button. No. What was that? What was what? Just shine it here so I can see what I'm doing. Okay. Hey, can you just keep the light so oh. I can see? Okay. I moved. Okay. First things first, we gotta increase the water Installed until dawn. Oh, good to know. Fired up. Mm, sounds kinda complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. <sighs> Turn it. There you go. Ah, oh, damn. It's okay. I mean, just try again. Oh, I gotta wait till the pressure gets up or something. Oh. Yay! That's more like it. I did it. All right. five, girl. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Quick time for the high five. All right. Just Josh and you. Really freaked out. Oh my God. Don't move. What? Nothing behind you. Yeah, right. Josh. Seriously. <laughs> all right, all right, your point. Dirty love. What? No. Where'd you 
get the first point? Because it started at 30? No, 15. Oh. Well, more like ping pong, yeah. <laughs> Wait, okay, so you can think of that too, right? Josh. What? The rhythm is like weirdly regular. Not, not, nothing regular about it. We should check it out. <laughs> Maybe we should check it out. Why? What if it's like a, a pipe that's about to burst or some problem with the furnace? Unlikely. If it were me, I wouldn't want this place to burn down in my watch. Yeah, right. I can't control the lights, I like, ah! It's totally Chris. God, I hope it's Chris. Face. Prank, which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared, admit it. I was not! Come on, you totally pissed yourself. Josh! I would have taken that light with you. What in God's name are you wearing? I found my true calling. <laughs> hmm. Please tell me you're gonna take a vow of silence. <laughs> okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? Oy, 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 oy. Here's our one way ticket. You know what? You know what? No, no. I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. Alright? So have fun. Oh, but watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. He's a schemer. Burn. Oh, what happened to your office, dude? What happened to your office? I would like to understand your feeling toward people who fear the supernatural. Ghosts, spirits, and other intangible <sighs> on the veil. Do you share this fear? Yeah. Uh Yeah, sure. He could be Victor. That's not reflected in the way you are playing your game now, is it? Is Sam hated Penetir? I don't know who that is. Penetir. And now, let us investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. Okay. You value what you respect in yourself and others. Which would you say was most important in a person? Loyalty or honesty? Oh God. Oh God, I don't know. Loyalty or honesty? Hmm. Hmm. Honesty. So, you would tell the truth, even if it resulted in an unpleasant outcome for a friend. 
And what about honesty then? And charity? Honesty. <laughs> charity is overrated, I suppose. Better to be true to yourself than to help others in need, eh? That's that's not what I meant. Again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. Oh, I don't like him. I don't like what this is doing to the game. This is probably really messing up the game, isn't it? I have a feeling that talking to him is m m like altering the game way more than I thought it was. It was just a prank, Han. Yes, I know. It's only been two hours of me playing this game. You don't need to recap it. The Today second is recap. The one year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy of Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. I know it would mean. So much to Hannah and Beth that we're we're all One year later. together, and I'm thinking of them. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. Boom. Butterfly effect. Excuse me. Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me? Was your sluttiness? Stop it, Mike. Why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Did you hear that? What in God's name are you wearing? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. But watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Well, that's how it's gonna I have be. a feeling this is where the scariness is about to start. Yes. Yes. So, yeah. Here. Chapter 3, Haunted. You must free your mind Ooh. of all preconceptions, drop all inhibitions. Haunted. Generally give yourself over entirely to the will of others, sublimating your every desire to the whims of the spirit master, which Spirit masters. And all present will remove their garments at my soul's discretion. Chris, come on, serious. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm deadly serious. <laughs> oh, shush it. Let's try this. Yeah. Oh, shush it. Okay, then. Let's see what happens. I don't like Ouija Ashley, boards. You're a recent convert. Why don't you be our medium? I'm going to play as Ashley now. Cool. Abracadabra. Uh, is anyone there? Hello? Pick up the phone. Spirit, spirit phone. Um, abracadabra. Come on. Um, if you can hear my voice, give us a sign. Yeah, like a peace sign or a Guys, stop sign. If you're not going to take this seriously. Okay, okay. Is anyone there? Wherever there is. There is here and here is now. Wait a minute. Did you do that? I didn't do anything. It's moving again. <laughs> H? What's it spelling? Hold on. How's this happening? Are you moving it? I swear, it's just moving. Oh, shit. Help? How are we supposed to help? I don't know. What does it help? mean? Help? We need to know who it is if we're supposed to help them. Who are you? Oh. oh. Here it goes. Okay, S. I. S. T. Sister. E. R. Sister. Sister. Who's sister? Oh, come on. Is this for real? Shut up. Ask it who's sister. Josh, it's it's gotta be. Yeah. Okay. Well, which sister is it then? Ashley, ask who it is. Hannah. Are we speaking to Hannah? Is that you? <sighs> oh God! <laughs> this is messed up. Josh, are you? I'm fine. Are you sure? Because we can stop. No, dude, it, it's cool. I want to hear what it says. Ooh. I don't know where to start? Think about it. If this is actually Hannah, I mean. Can find out what happened that night. Josh? I can handle it. Okay. Um, let me think. What happened to you? Hannah, we miss you. And we want to know what happened to you. Can you, can you tell us what happened? B? E? T? R? Uh oh. I don't like this. 
betrayed. What does she mean? Oh, it, it's still going. Oh, God. K I L L. Killed. D. D? No. Killed. We didn't kill them. It was just a prank. A Ash, calm, calm down, okay? Just, we, we, we need to find out more. I'm sorry. I am guys, so guys, sorry. What, what do they mean? Ask them what, what happened. It's, it's, it's the only way to know. Ask them, Ash. Okay. Who killed you? Hannah, who was it? L? I? B? The library. Maybe there's something in the library here? R? O? O? Proof. There, there's, there's proof. In the library? Oh, no. oh. oh, God. Holy shit. Chris? Oh, it's this creepy. Josh, I don't know what's going on. Listen, I don't know. I don't know if you think messing with me is somehow going to help me deal with my grief or whatever, but this is not cool. Josh, no. You wanted to use the spirit board. Hey, hey calm down. It's, it's not actually. I don't need this right now, okay? You guys are full of it. Should, should we go after him? Ah, man. I, I mean, he'll be okay. Let's. Just, just give him some time. I don't blame him. That was crazy. The pointer flew right off the table. If, if, if you were faking it, you were doing one hell of a job. I wasn't faking anything. I think we should Ooh. do what it says. We should look <sighs> for the creepy. library. Status update. Mike. Yep. Yes. Okay, where'd she go? She is super gone. Okay. Yes. Where did you go? This is not funny. Jess. Buddy. Is she in there? Buddy. I'm ah! Whoa! Christ! Scared the blue out of my jeans. <laughs> the hell is that doing in there anyway? How? How'd that fly up to the window? Jessica, oh come on. How did it even fly up to the window though? Jess? Hun? Light Hun? of my life? Light of my life? My son and stars? I totally promise I won't murder you when I'm <laughs> oh! oh my god! No. <laughs> that was so good! Not, no! <laughs> wait, 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 you had to see those. You had to I'm see those. not Let's seeing it. No! No! no. no. <laughs> you recorded that? <laughs> Look at your face! <laughs> I was scared, oh Jess. You can't just jump out at somebody. I'm in the middle of the woods. It's I'm sorry to scare you. If we send that to anybody, <gasps> you're I'm what? Gonna kill you. I didn't know you had such a cute little lady like scream, Michael. <laughs> <laughs> Guess you never really know someone until you've scared the pants off of them. Fine, you win. Alright, fine. You win. It's not a contest. But I do win. Every time. Uh huh. Whatever you say, uh -oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. A totem. Okay. Guidance. Let's see that one again. Oh, I missed one. Who is that, though? I don't know. Some with water wheel. Oh, shit's about to get real, isn't it? Wow. It's kind of like a real winter wonderland out here now. Hey, girl, you know I'll help you up? Mm-hmm. 
Yeah, let's go. Making sure you were behind me. Yep. Oh boy. I don't like this. I don't. I don't like goblins. A squirrel. I see fire off in the distance. What? Do you hear that? No. Oh. Hello. Someone there? Okay, let's keep going then. Probably gonna be another dude that jumps out any second now. Charming. If everything you described, Michael. Wait, what? It's heaven. I love it. Yeah. Yeah, this place looks like crap. Oh. Check out this mask. Sure. Times. Okay. Oh, frickin' deer, man. What is that? I'm not sure I want to know. Uh... Let's comfort the deer. Hey, bud. Hey, buddy. God, the poor thing. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Mike, it's in so much pain. It'll be over soon. Okay, buddy. It'll be over soon. Run! Run! Whoa, hello, yeah. Yeah. Shortcut. Oh, 
Oh, you dumb. Help Jessica. Come on, we gotta go. I am. <sighs> Grab the key. Mike, get the key. Get it open. <gasps> Ah. Uh. What? I don't know, Angel. <sighs> Full time. Oh, bullshit. No, 100%. 100%. 110. Oh. Holy crap, I feel like I just ran I'm the marathon. I'm almost positive this game's about Wendigos now. Is it or at least it's gonna have Wendigos. Yeah, gotta be. Things are crazy fast. I mean, I didn't see it. Hey, things are not gonna come barging in, I promise. How can you be sure? Because I'm pretty sure bears don't know how to open cabin doors. I've seen them open car doors. What? Where? On the internet. <laughs> On the internet. Really? Okay, well, this isn't the internet, Jess. Right? This is real life. And I promise you that no bear or anything else is going to open that cabin door. I guess you're right. Okay. I'm almost feeling relaxed again. Almost. Huh. Typical. Urgh. This is not the cozy chalet I was promised, Mike. Yeah, it's a bit drafty or something, right? Well, there is a fireplace. Well, we don't need a fire to heat things up. Haha. <laughs> Michael. Good one. I am a lady, and a lady needs a proper romantic setting. Okay. A lady would like to cuddle up with her man by a nice cozy fire bathed in atmospheric mood lighting. Right. It'll get plenty toasty once we're rubbing up against each other. Mike. Yeah. Fire and mood lighting. Yes. My lady. Fire and mood lighting. I am good at words. <laughs> I mean, we already saw that Emily was getting lit on fire anyways, so you know. Twist. Ah, this will take care of the mood lighting. That's right, stoke the fire. All right, logs are ready to go. Just need a match. I need to find the match first. Okay, what's this? Oh, yes. Don't point the gun at her. Huh? How you like me now? Oh my god. Why do guns make them go completely blind? <clears throat> Nothing. Right. <sighs> She'll never understand what we have together. Okay, matches. Matches, matches, matches. Oh. Shit. Fuck. Mike. What? Oh, crap. What? Where is it? What? What's wrong? Gone. It is gone. Her phone. Yes. Slow down. What is gone? My freaking phone, Sherlock. Can you find it? Crap. No. I must have dropped it outside. I can't lose my phone. My parents will kill me. You can always get a new one. That's like my fourth one this year. Okay. Okay. Well, I'll help you look for it. It's got to be outside. Yeah. I'm not going out there. I don't think we want to go out there right now with the bear or whatever it is. <sighs> Fine. I'm not going out there. Found the matches. Lucky, lucky. Gonna fire up some nookie. You've been dying to use that line since we got here, haven't you? More fire references. <laughs> Victor will kill you. Man one, fire zero. Very nice. A bravo. No fire lights that quickly without gasoline. All right, my lady. What comes? I think. Well, I I 
wish we had some booze. Booze. Uh, well, uh, if I'd have known that ahead of time. I don't know. I'm kind of I'm not feeling it yet. Am I doing something wrong? No, 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 no. I mean, I thought you were one way, but you're kind of another way. Does that make sense? It's, it's not your fault. Uh, Jess, I really like you. Mm-hmm. I think I am. Well, just give me a chance, and I will show you what you need. Well, I am liking your confidence. Mike, the shutters. What about them? Um, close them, please? <laughs> There's no one out there. I feel like someone's watching us. I don't like it. Yes, really. It's fine. Yeah, just really Victor likes to watch. Like okay, shutter it is. Oh. I think I want to go over to those shutters. I know Josh is Victor, but he likes to watch. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I think I'm a little freaked out, and it's hard for me to like keep this up. And look, I act all super confident and like a total sexy babe and everything, but underneath, I gotta be honest. I'm really kind of insecure. Really. I had no idea. Jess, you've got to be kidding me. What? You have nothing to be insecure about. Oh, <laughs> you have no idea. Sure I do. He's just like me and <laughs> Keep what up? But oh, you know. You know how to handle yourself. It only makes it better. Yeah. And that's super fucking hot. Mm -hmm. oh, really? Yeah, hell yeah it is. Come here. Oh god, here comes the murderer. Maybe I know how to handle you too. Oh. I am definitely ready to be handled. Oh. seeing right now. Oh. They're undressing each other. Oh yeah. We all know what's going on there. Oh, okay. I don't know if I want to. Oh, well, something broke open. Something. Oh, cool. your phone what how is it my phone i don't know it just came through the window oh for fuck's sake god damn it what those goddamn assholes probably followed us out here to fuck with us and just when we were getting down to business Because I'm now we're going to 
Oh, the Fuendigo. Oh. Yep, there it goes. No, I think that was Victor. I think Victor's following them. Do you really think the girls were communicating with us? I don't know. I don't know Ugh. if I wish they were, if I wish they were. I guess we should find out. Wendigo sounds like the furry version of Wendigo. He, he looked like he was keeping it together, but... I think we shouldn't have mentioned his sisters. I mean, this is why we came back up here. Yeah, but not to, like, have a seance. Maybe we went too far. Oh, she's oh, shit. Holy crap! Are you okay? Secret so. button. Look. What? There was something behind the books. What is that? Is it a button? Why would there be a button? That's a good question. Should I push it? That's what buttons were for, I guess. Well, in the in the in the prologue thing, the thing with the red vision was the was the arson guy. So I'm guessing that's Victor. Whoa, panel opens. That explodes. Are we like in a movie right now? If we are, I hope it's around. God. Leave it to the Washingtons to have secret passages in their house. I mean, maybe they didn't even know. This place is super old. Mm -hmm. So, should we take a look? Yeah, after you. No, 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 no. You go. Gee, <laughs> thanks. Fuendigo notices human. Ooh, what's this? This dinner? Oh. Oh. Okay. Whoa, is what this... did you find? Oh. Oh. Oh boy. Tell them bleed them like pains ripped their soft skin off. Sixteen years I waited for pretty little Hannah and Beth. Holy cow. Now, now Ash, I, I, I don't want to freak you out, but, but look at this. What? Chris, what is that? I I think this might be what the spirit board wanted us to find. The clue? Yeah, it's a letter. Let me see it. It's a, a threat. Chris, <laughs> this is serious. We need to find Josh right now. How is a needle going to walk, walk across the screen? Okay. Totally normal. Uh, what was that? Okay. Actually, after Hannah and Beth? Probably. So, that would be really messed up. <sighs> Here's the front door. So, um, I've just been thinking about something I saw earlier with Sam. What? There was like this wanted poster, like full on Western style, you know? So? And Sam really thought there was someone following her around. So, so what you're saying, there's some criminal up on the mountain with us? Maybe. Well, there was that guy I told you well, about. Wait, 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 what guy? The guy who threatened the Washingtons. I mean, he, he said he wanted to take revenge by burning the whole place down. And then I found that crazy psycho letter. Chris. If this is your way of trying to make me feel better, you're fired. 
Oh God. Okay. Clown guy. Nice butt. Okay. There's a scarecrow in the room now. That's cool. Hello, sir. How are you? I'm going to show you some uh, pictures of people that you have to know. Okay. But maybe you don't like them as much as you pretend to. Mm. Do I get to well, pick here? This is an exercise in honesty. Tell me which person from each pair you like the most. Take your time. Your answers are important. Cool. Can I get names? Uh, Sam. Duh. Uh, Matt. Duh. Ashley or Chris? Ooh. I think I like... I like Chris. That's a hard one, though. That's a tough one. Jessica or Mike? I like Mike. I do not like Jessica. That's right. Smile at me like creep. Emily or Josh? You know, I really hate Emily, so... Ooh, Ashley, duh. Emily and Jessica so far are just the worst. Tell me, in this little game you're playing so diligently, who is it? Oh. I dislike Emily. Because she's cheating. A bit too bitchy for your taste. Often the lack of confidence manifests itself as overconfidence. Think about that. Is that not just a Chris and Ashley are like dead head and head. I like them both. Oh. Once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. Yes, we will talk again soon, fair doctor. Ugh. Previously on Until Dawn. Let's get a recap of what we did today, because I think we're about to wrap up. Hold on! There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. Apparently, he had warned them against pursuing their construction project in Blackwood Pines and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. Yes. Oh, I didn't hear that part. Sister? Ask it whose sister? Josh, it's it's gotta be. Which sister is it then? Ah! Run! Oh. Oh. oh my god. Yes. Hey. Ooh. They're starting to get taken. Come here. Come here, lover boy. Ah! 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 
looked like her neck got snapped. Loyalty. Oh, fuck! Oh, fuck! What the fuck? Jessica! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Jess! Jess! As soon as it lets me play, I'm just gonna save and stop. I don't know if I need to save. Okay. Can I, can I pause? I can. Okay. This seems like a good stopping spot. Just because it's the beginning of the chapter. Um, I will pick this back up again because I am enjoying this. Um, even though I don't like being scared. <laughs> um, but I will definitely come back to this one because I'm having fun and I want to know how it ends. Um, so thanks for joining me on Halloween. Bye.